It appears that the British royal family is closing ranks against Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. Princess Anne has teamed up with the future King and Queen, Prince William and Catherine, to block the Sussex potential return to the royal fold. The shift in the royal hierarchy has been palpable, with Catherine, the Princess of Wales, emerging as the most popular member of the British royal family. Her favourability rating stands at an impressive 66% closely followed by her husband, Prince William, at 65%. Meanwhile, King Charles, despite battling his own health issues, retains a respectable 56% approval rating. The unflappable trio of Catherine, William, and the undeniably, badass, Princess Anne seem to have taken charge, determined to keep the Sussexes at arm's length. This move comes as a significant blow to Harry and Meghan, who have been vocal in their criticism of the monarchy and have made several attempts to reclaim their place within the royal family. The tensions between the Sussexes and the rest of the royal clan have been simmering for years, ever since Harry and Meghan's bombshell decision to step down as senior working royals and relocate to the United States. The couple's tell-all interview with Oprah Winfrey, in which they leveled accusations of racism and neglect against the institution, only served to deepen the rift. Now, it appears that the royal hierarchy has shifted in favor of the more traditional and stoic members of the family, with Catherine, William, and Princess Anne leading the charge to exclude the Sussexes from the royal fold. Princess Anne is known for her no-nonsense approach and unwavering loyalty to the crown, says royal expert Camilla Tomini. She's not one to mince words, and it's clear that she's firmly on the side of the institution, rather than the renegade Sussexes. The Princess Royal's recent return to royal duties, following a concussion-related incident, has only served to solidify her position as a formidable force within the family. Her appearance at the Riding for the Disabled Association National Championships, where she was warmly welcomed by the organization's leadership, was seen as a clear message of her continued commitment to the monarchy. Meanwhile, Catherine and William have also been making strategic moves to cement their position as the future of the royal family. The couple's recent tour of the United States, which was widely praised for its polished and diplomatic approach, has only further cemented their status as the new face of the monarchy. Catherine and William understand the importance of public perception, says royal commentator Richard Fitzwilliams. They've been carefully cultivating an image of stability and tradition, which stands in stark contrast to the Sussex more controversial approach.